Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah
the scoop. I think you guys get here. I need the scoop Thanks. too. Ew, bro. <laughs> what the f? In Mexico, everything is different. No? Yeah. <laughs> everything is scary. <laughs> Lupita, please be careful. I feel like everything is um, it's so scary. <sighs> One time I was at my grandma's house in Mexico, my dad's mom, and a metal cup just fell out of nowhere. My mom told me too recently that they went to, you know, when they went to Mexico. Yeah. That um, they told them a scary story. Oh like, yeah. Of what happened? Yeah. That's... Someone did like brujería on them. To your parents? No, 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 no. To my uncles. But basically, my mom said, you know how the whole theory, or not the theory, but like the concept of insidious, how you go into like another realm or something mm -hmm. like that. Hello. Hello. <laughs> that it's all true. That literally what happened, kind of like similar to the movie happened to them like that. What was watching them that kept the eye on the whole family was like this Elsa doll. Like the person could see like what was happening because of the doll. It was in the house. It was just everywhere. Oh, that creeped me the f out. Like yeah. those Elsa at 3 a.m. videos. She's right there. Is she moving? She's moving. You guys. Wait, I, 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 I think she's moving. That bitch. That was so fucked up. Remember that story my mom said about her coworker? Yeah, somebody gave them an Elmo doll, and then their house burned down, and they couldn't find the Elmo doll anywhere. Well, part of their house or something like that. Yeah. My coworker, I recently met her, and she was so cool. Like she was really like literally the dopest person ever, right? But she told me that she she had with like the Ouija board, and she did like a bunch of weird. And I got what so scared. Yeah, she basically told me that she would do all that type of stuff. And I was like, ah, bitch, like, why are you playing? And then after, she stayed serious. <laughs> and I remember one time I was looking at her keychains, you know? Mm -hmm. And then um, basically one day um, I was washing my car and I put all the stuff in the back, like in the trunk, right? And I seen there was like this little doll, like the one she had in her keychain in the back of my trunk. Ooh. And I was like, how the f did what? I get back there? And I got so scared, I threw the bitch. I'm gonna win this parking. Pumpkin carving. <laughs> parking. Damn, this is magnetic. Oh. Yeah, that's cool, huh? That's kind of screwed. Oh, fuck. You're going to scare me. Oh, my God, I was bleeding. Cut that out. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> you, you do that, and I, then you get scared. No, I, I was trying to burp. Remember that when I was little, I told you guys I saw like the the, the guy with like all black with the sombrero. <gasps> so like in the trailers, you oh seen that too? My, yes, but in the trailers? Yes, in my house. Yeah, and me too. When I was little, and I didn't want to tell my mom because she didn't want to. I don't think she'll believe me. Someone else saw it too that doesn't live in the trailer, so I think it goes around. Mine literally was a guy with the sombrero. With a black hat. No, but he, mine was glowing. If that, I don't what know. Color? If that makes sense. White? Yeah, literally glowing. But he was like this. Like, like floating? He was standing like this, like literally t the door like this. I thought it was my dad, so I was like, Dad, Dad, and no one answered. And you guys were all kids, huh? Like that's scary! Sorry. Oh my yeah. gosh, those look so cool! No, don't look at one. Let me see. No! Oh, I'm gonna win. There we, is? We can work with that. <coughs> Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> She'll be there digging for her life. And can we add that powder thing, Monica? I'll be down to do it. What are you talking about? So you're gonna about? tell us, me, I don't know if um, MG has Hell no! MG has her makeup No, you're too violent. You'll give us a concussion. No, but you don't have to do it. She's gonna throw it on everybody, not just one of us. On our birthdays, dude? I don't even want to invite you no more, because when we cut the pastel and we do the mordida. Bro, mordida threw my whole cake on me. Were you guys mad? Yes, your mom, yes. Was cool. your mom was busting up. I don't want to get scared because I live here. What about sleep paralysis? Have you oh my god, that's one of the worst, dude. One time that happened to me. Wait, I have the wrong spooky one. Wait, what? Is this one mine? Oh yeah, I'm tripping. My hole's too big. <sighs> I, heard you're not, I heard you're not supposed to see faces. And if you do with someone doing um some to you, if you see their faces. What does it mean when um you turn on a candle and it turns black? Oh, Supposedly God. that's brujeria too. Really? Cause like, but I, you'll turn on that candle and like, candle. oh shit. My uncle's the only one that touches the candles and just yesterday Gio put that one on because we always have a candle for my tia and Maxi's brother and it turned like that. Mom, what significa cuando prendes una vela y se pone negro el cristal? Malas vibras, mala energía.
Okay, gracias. I thought it was just my uncle, so they're probably doing something to my uncle, and then I don't know about you. Because Jessica told you when the light lit up on her, it was the last day of my grandpa's rosario. Before we used to have the ca the couches all against the wall, right? You could see to the kitchen, but it's so f dark at night. Jessica said she was already feeling kind of like you know when you feel scared, yeah, like when you have that weird feeling, whatever. She said she was feeling that, and all of a sudden she sees the. F light just turn on the candle turn on yeah. and then after they're all tripped out because all the candles were turned off before i remember when my grandpa had passed away mm -hmm. that like around the time ah! no no that was so funny. it does that it does that it's okay it's full choice stop I'm just kidding, it was only on two batteries. Monica, <laughs> please, I'm gonna cry. Oh, it's okay. Get it! Get it! Get it! You No, I'm being for real. Are you lying no, to yeah, me? No, it's fine. We can still see ourselves, right? <sighs> no, you're not even in the freaking video. I am. Hey, that's the fuck there. out of me. That's good, me too. I'm trying to get this shit. Monica, why are you pressing out there? Are you sure? What's something funny that happened in Mexico? I don't know. I'm about to We're run just away gonna from record the my tia, my tia that owns the store, they went out to like this, like somewhere else, like to a, like a mall kind of. And me and my cousin Felipe started selling the shit for cheaper. And then like the whole rancho knew. So every, it was getting packed. Like everyone kept going. Because we were fucking selling everything so cheap and, and we got in trouble oh my for, god and we ran out of the whole store and then we got in trouble wait are you from here Lupita? yeah i was born here you oh. dumb hoe you're racist <laughs> have you guys ever called 911 and they sh they showed up to your house when you guys were here no um, have you i think i did that and the cop showed up no actually i didn't do it it was lupita the little lupita she called the cops and then when she seen them come she ran home <laughs> I got in trouble for letting her do that. I remember I called the cops and then I passed it to Fabi really fast. And we were like, hello, 911. And what did Fabi say? She was like, I think my sister called you guys on accident. Oh my um, god, yours looks like an eye. Yeah, that looks cool. I think you won, Monica. I got even wonder if I had to finish mine. Yeah. Either. I don't know what the MJ doing. Yeah, there was this girl um, and she was telling me that she went to Italy and she she booked like a kind of like a hotel But it was a girl's house like a lady's house and they had like different rooms, I guess and that lady was like a witch and um, I forgot how it went But basically like they had to leave right away and like they were so scared to leave because like, you know, the lady knows, you know they and found something under the bed. Yeah, they found like a like a doll like a doll under their, their bed. Yeah, so they wanted to leave that same day they didn't even and, like and the people Sheesh. they found a hole in the wall <laughs> oh yeah they found a hole okay. they saw a bunch of weird shit, like on the doors oh yeah and, and then they, they were like something under the bed like a letter or something and then they were trying to get away right i'm so nervous right now i don't want to talk about nothing it's a, i'm like literally so scared i want to like leave the house already it's not scary we can't they can't touch us I was supposed to hang out with some guy today too. Wow, Monica, you're really an artist. I get you. <laughs> Monica, <laughs> why did <laughs> you, you fart? That's so weird. Ew! That doesn't smell, I swear to God. <laughs> Ew, it doesn't smell. It doesn't smell like how you farted last time. I almost threw up with money. It actually did not smell. Just like Please. Money. It doesn't smell. Dude, it doesn't smell Lupita because I haven't been eating bad, Lupita's so I'm so, only right now. Lupita's so embarrassing. When we were at work, I couldn't. We, went out, we went outside to eat for her lunch. I farted. <laughs> I got so disgusted. Dude. She started to like gag in front of everyone. I was like, what are you doing? I couldn't, huh, Monica? I gag for everything. It's so annoying. I cannot, like, I can't control it. It just, it's naturally. <laughs> just <laughs> naturally. <laughs> what? I don't have anything. I just like this. Oh, your first stinks. <laughs> oh, no. no, it doesn't. That shit was a long time ago. <laughs> I think you're smelling your your um upper lip personally. Mm. Those are fighting words. Those mm. really are. That one art school called Mylon? APCH? What? That one art school called Mylon. My <laughs> What? <laughs> we were all supposed to be in Halloween costumes. Nelly Your is a, um, a bat. Monica is you. And I am... You two beetles naturally. <laughs> and then MJ is f***ing. I'm Ari. I'm like, it's Ari. Oh my god, <laughs> That's Ari, bad, Ari. baby. Are we done? Yeah, but your arm's gonna hurt tomorrow from the... Do you want me to help you? No. Oh. <laughs>
Yeah. No, I don't I want, want to. Get super scared. No, okay. I do not. Please. Let, let okay, okay let's go talk about this somewhere else. Please. Where do we go? In the, the cemetery? cemetery? No, yes. no. Do <laughs> Did you use screenshots? Screenshots? Okay. Yeah, Gio. Leave a candle. I always does that. You don't have candles, work, Monica? I didn't even say the story about my grandpa. After my grandpa passed away during the Rosario or whatever, Bobby woke up, me and my mom were like in the kitchen. And then she tells my mom, oh, like my grandpa appeared in my dream or whatever, but uh, I don't want to scare you. She's like, tell me, like, tell me what he said. And she said to tell my mom to stop crying and that he's okay. But that she said she didn't even remember his voice, but she heard him like super clearly. Have you guys ever read The Giving Tree? Oh yeah, I I've heard, heard this. about it. Yes. So basically, I don't know. I have this thing. It's I I've been buying kids books so I could I could like give them to my kids, you know. Mm -hmm. So I had recently got the the giving tree, mm -hmm. and I had told my mom I was like it has like a beautiful meaning to it, you know. Yeah, it does. So I had read it to all of them, literally everybody. I was reading it to them. You know how my grandma was in my mom's room for like the longest yeah. time ever. Yeah. My mom thought it was already kind of like time to start throwing stuff away. So one day she was just like randomly she was just going through all the stuff, and then after she found a note that was from my grandma that said. El árbol quiere paz, pero el viento no, lo, no le da, or something like that. And then she literally had drawn like a little tree to it. And then my mom started to cry because she was like, oh my god, it looks like the, uh. the tree from the book MJ read us. And then after that, I think like a few weeks after, you know how she got cremated? They were looking for like a little box to put her ashes in. And then after my... They found a tree home. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of pictures, like screenshots of the ones she thought were cute. And my tia Chela had no idea what had happened like with us about the book and all that. So my tia had sent her a few and then my mom seen that there was one with the tree on it too. And then my mom got sad again and was like, what the f and then one day, me and my mom and my dad were in my mom's room, where, like where my grandma used to sleep. Mm -hmm. And out of nowhere, the f***ing radio just turned on, at, like literally her she, radio, her yeah, radio no, turned well. on out of nowhere. Like and me and my mom were like, what the f***? It was so scary, but it was like, I don't know, like comforting too. Yeah. It's because her grandma used to love listening to her little radio. She would always turn it off. And she would say it was like her little kid. Yeah. Oh. Oh, it's sad. It sucks that one day your parents are going to go too, you know? Shut up. Oh. <laughs> what? It's okay. That's like I got the Monica, you know. Everybody it knows it's you. It doesn't smell. And that one f does. <laughs> that one dates. Dude, this is the only reason we brought masks. Who beat that? Why? That one smelled spicy. My Diana told this story in the last video about this lady that she saw coming from the atrium at, from in the front what? of the plaza. Coming from the iglesia, basically. Okay. In the plaza in front of the church. And she said that <coughs> she saw her like early, early, like five in the morning. And then she saw her again a couple days later. Uh, but she was like dressed in like dark clothes and she had a bag with her. And my grandma called me today and said that she investigated that it, it's some lady that appears to people. <gasps> And she's fucking. I, they call her like Ew. Chela La Bella or something. I don't know what the hell she said. Uh -huh. Wait, I wrote it down. <laughs> she walks around with an escoba and I don't know what the hell. What happened to her? Uh, she died. But she would, when she was alive, she would always sweep the plaza or the iglesia. Aww. That's so cute. Yeah. Damn, they don't let her rest? What the hell? So, <laughs> well, Monica, I'm impressed. Okay, I give it to Monica and I'm second. <laughs> You saw light too? Yeah. I saw light too. Like what do you mean? Like a car? No. Or maybe it was a car because it always does that. You sure? I think, yeah. Well, light is a good thing though. No. Chola la brocha. Why they call her like Chole that? Chola la brocha? Chola la brocha? I don't know. Uh, they don't know where she lives. They think she lives in the atrio. They get stuck in their... They get stuck in like the time zone or whatever. What? Yeah, that's what why you. Yeah. That's why you see them. They're always wearing the same thing. Or they're yeah. always doing the same sh**. So, um, somebody in my parents' pueblo passed away from shit like that. Uh, we were told that this little girl came up to the parents. And mm -hmm. she was with her mom. And the mom started talking to them saying, my little girl sees things and she's saying that your daughter is still here and she's asking like what happened because it happened so fast she doesn't know what happened to her that she's asking what's going on like why is everybody here? like during her funeral in her service oh it's like um in ghost or like in lovely bones too yeah like Aww. that you know that's what my mom told me too when you die in like a 
like a tragic accident, your soul gets lost. That's so sad. What is sad. it called? It's called like poor or something. Purgatory. Purgatory. What is that? It's, it's like you're between you're between heaven and earth, basically. Everybody's ready to show their <laughs> wait. She's too funny. No, I'm good. Alrighty, pumpkin reveal, everybody. Nelly first. Okay, okay. mine is called the pumpkin imperfections and. And it's scratched up. It's scratched up. Period. Got in an accident, huh? No, it looks like Monica. No, is Mine it, is, is an eyeball. Because Monica has no eyes. I mean, she has eyes, but she can't see, right? She has four eyes. It, it has to describe you. You have a brain, you can't think. <laughs> 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 That's why it's hollow in here. <laughs> Bitch, I'll put a brain in right now. <laughs> I have a big ass brain now. This is so little, though. This is my brain because apparently Monica thinks I have no brain. I have hearts because I'm a heart kind person. Does that make sense? <laughs> no, bitch. I have hearts because I'm a really kind person and people use me. And then I have a scary thing because I'm gonna turn evil later. Demon time? No, hell no. <laughs> like, I'm gonna be a bitch to everyone. Why? You have to wait. Mm -hmm. yeah, so you're yeah, your golf ball. <laughs> I also have a, a candle inside if you guys want to see. You took a screenshot. <laughs> she went at home. She took a screenshot. Hello, Hello. okay, everybody. Thank you guys. Thank you, you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Happy Halloween.